there guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new here welcome hopefully you consider being part of the frugal j family for all my new subscribers thank you thank you thank you so much and for my oldies and goodies thank you for your continuous love and support i love you guys so so very much i have a very very tiny ross haul but i wanted to share with you guys i did okay it's not that big but i've been sitting here recording so you're gonna see me you're gonna see me in this outfit maybe three times i'm sorry i should have maybe changed my shirt or something but you know what? i'm just trying to get this done because easter is done and i just want to record i mean record i want to redo my house like little by little just give it some new touches because i want to do boho with some modern farmhouse because i have a lot of farmhouse and of course if i get rid of it my husband's gonna be like girl what is you doing like you know i change my house a lot he tells me he's lucky he's still here and i haven't changed him but he's my boo he's my boo anyways guys so i want to incorporate some boho into my decor and i don't know if i'm going about it the right way i'm looking in pinterest and like youtube videos to just give me an idea this is not boho but i want simplicity i want simple i don't want a lot of stuff in my house i want to declutter as much as i can so in my coffee bar i have a lot of little signs from dollar tree and i might keep one or two but i just want to put very simple a sign or two and just you know and that's it so i found this one at ross that says coffee is always a good idea and i think this will fit under like my counter it could be uh, spit it out girl it'll fit under my countertop and i could just sit it there by my keurig and this part right here is like lifted i don't know if it's 3d that i want to say it has some like dimension i don't even know if i'm saying the right words guys but you already know what i'm trying to say so i thought this was cute and it was 10.99 at ross so i'm gonna try it and if it doesn't work just take it back just take it back then I found pour some sugar on me coffee. How cute! And black and white, right up my alley, guys. And this one was $4.99. So I was like, yes, it could be right cute next to it, like this. Like just like this next to it. Maybe I'll find I'm going to Hobby Lobby tomorrow. Maybe I can find something to lift this one up a little bit so it's not sitting on my counter. And then guys, I'm all about some chunky and a shoes yes i said the word am i am i'm about chunky chunky shoes like me and billy alice would be besties if we can share shoes okay so i found these they're kind of heavy but they took me back to when i was like in high school in the 80s and stuff look at this ah i was like yes and i tried them on i was like oh you guys are going home they were the last ones and they were in size nine they're a little big on my foot, which is weird because I'm eight and a half slash nine, you know, depending on the shoe. Because sometimes I can grab a nine and a half in gym shoes if I want to be comfortable and wear socks. But eight and a half, nine is usually what I wear. And I was in love. My kids and my husband are going to look at me like, I don't care. I don't care. Do you, boo. I'm telling you, do you. Don't worry about what anybody tells you. If you like something, if you're in love with it, if it makes you happy, do it. As long as you're not hurting anybody, just do it, honey. Do it. And I'm doing it. <laughs> These were $21.99. So, yeah, I saw some Steve Madden ones, and they were not $20. They weren't. They were not $22, bucks, guys. So, I was like, yes. Yes. Throw it in my cart. All right, guys. This one, I bought only one, and I'm probably going to kick myself in the butt because I want to order this sofa very soon and it has like that camel color like leathery camel color i don't know because i want to do boho guys throw some like black and whites or some grays i don't know i don't know yet and i want to do some like some wicker and whatever you call it bamboo wicker i don't freaking know i don't know but i know i like it so i found this mirror and i i want to put it that i have two empty like not empty because right now i have like these window <sighs> i don't know what you call them that i bought them at hobby lobby and i just want to put two mirrors 
expected one on each side there goes my my mess and i'm in love i'm in love guys oh my god i'm in love with this and this one was 24.99 everywhere i go looking for a big mirror they're like 25 bucks look at this mess you can see all my mess in this closet that i'm hiding in but look 25 dollars i'm gonna kick myself in the butt if it fits a wonderful and there was only one left and i left it and i go back tomorrow and it's not there usually i don't buy frames like this canvas or whatever you call this but the doors and the studs and the locks on the doors was just calling my name and then i have blue in my home I have these colors in my house and this is the color sofa that i want to buy almost just a little darker guys i don't know this thing caught i think it could fit this into a boho style but i'm in love with the doors this is what attracted me to this frame to this canvas whatever you call this just like a canvas and i usually don't buy stuff like this i really don't but i was and this door just called me it was like jay come here open these doors <laughs> but i thought it was pretty cool and i sent the picture to my husband because my husband's very iffy when you know stuff like this that looks cheapy almost i don't know some of them look cheapy like when they put like grapes and <laughs> i don't know guys what i'm trying to say but i don't know this one really called my name the doors and i figured once i order my sofa and it comes in and it's a little darker than this the leather but i think it'll stand out and it has that pop of blue so i'm gonna put this i have an empty space right now on that wall that i wanted to do a book like uh i wanted to do a wall like paint that wall dark and then i found these gold like stickers at dollar tree that i was gonna do almost like make it look like wallpaper and I was going to put a shelf with all my Dollar Tree book finds. But I don't know. I think I'm just going to put the dark wall and then hang this. And I think the pop of like charcoaly black and this picture on that wall will stand out. So nice. So I think that's what I'm going to do, guys. I think that's what I'm going to do. And this one was $19.99, guys. $19.99. But yeah, guys. That's what I found. Very small haul, but I wanted to share all my finds today. So I've been sitting here. I have recorded three, four videos. I don't know. So you're going to see me looking like this, but it's okay. It's okay. We're all familia here. We are familia. You guys don't mind. You just want to see what I bought. You don't care if, if I even comb my hair. You don't. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I hope you're having a great weekend so far. Um... I might do a few things with my husband tomorrow. I want to go to Hobby Lobby so bad because I'm looking for some like dry looking almost like wheat or whatever so I can put in this clear vase that I have because I'm telling you guys, I'm into that decluttering, simple and just changing things in my house. That's that's the mood I'm in right now. That's my vibe. So I don't know, guys, let me know down below if you guys are going through this too or if it's just me. I just want changes. Ever since I came home from the hospital, I just want changes I want simple, I want to declutter, I just want to change things around, okay? So, anyway, guys, hopefully you guys find something that you are looking for. I don't know if this is something, you know, but I did share, like, Dollar Tree and Target. Hopefully you guys find something from there that you might be looking for. Or if you're just looking for decor, go check out your Ross. They have amazing prices, and you can find a little bit of everything, okay? But anyways, guys, I'll stop. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. Thank you for everything. I love you guys. Be kind to one another. And I'll catch you on my next video.